Hello everybody, welcome back to Mum's Eye View. Last week you may have joined us when we cooked a lovely roast chicken. Today is the vegetarian option for my sister. And what we, we have a leek butter bean mushroom crumble. Oh, Ooh. that's a tongue twister. It is. Sam, you can start chopping up some leeks, please. Yes, I can. If you can start chopping them up about pieces so big. Yeah, okay. got you. I'm going to get some I butter in the pan. Yeah. Okay, about 25 grams of butter in it. The links will be in the description box below, which tell you exactly what quantities to use. Right, so we're just going to add a small amount of oil to the butter as well. I'm going to do two at once. Do you want to chuck some Double those in? Double whammy. Huh? Yeah, I'm scared of my hands near her. Why? Don't it's all under control. Right. right, so the leeks are in. We're going to cook these for about five minutes and then you want to add the mushrooms as the leeks start breaking down. So this is a pretty easy one, Ian. Yeah, this is pretty much the ideal recipe for when you first get home from work. You just want to throw stuff together in a pan, put it in the oven. 45 minutes done, healthy meal for the kids. Yeah. Perfect. Right, so leeks have been in five minutes, mushrooms Ooh. going in. You can still see they start breaking down. Sam, if you can open up the tin of tomatoes yep. for me. And Nick, if you can give us a half a spoon of sugar just to go into it. What's that going to do? All it's going to do is just take down some of the acidity from the tomatoes themselves. Pour it straight in. Oh. Wonderful. Do you want a bit of this time? Yes, please. If you can just pull us off a good piece of sprigs of those. What's a sprig? Like a hot, you, you don't want to twig. Is it like one of those things? Yeah, you can pull off. That's it. Oh. Perfect. Uh, All like that. You do it, Ian. Candle or cake? That's what I felt <laughs> like, candle or cake. I bet people don't remember that. Do you remember candle or cake? Wonderful. Maybe it's just us. Did you do candle or cake? He's, he was a boy, Nick. No. He was generally. a boy. <laughs> he was, he was, he was, was a boy. boy. Once upon a time. <laughs> right, so that's been in for now five to ten minutes. It's pretty good. So if we want to add in the butter beans and some of the spinach, please. Yep. Do I just pour them in, Ian? Yeah, of course you can. All we do is just give them a little rinse off under the tap with some cold water. So Which really you've been already drained, done. Really done. Straight in. We're just going to fold oh, that in. Oh, oh, I'm burning Wonderful. Oh, her one job. Another this is handful. good. This spinach is already washed. Perfect. Love a bit of pre-washed. Who has time to wash? Who has time to wash in general? She doesn't. Right, that's going to break down pretty quickly. I would say probably one to two minutes. And once that's broken down, we can pop that in the bowl. Yummy. And now we're going to go on to really trying to make your, your, your crumble topping. Okay, what do you need? Move that out of the way. Right, if you can, first of all, melt me 25 grams of butter. So pretty much the same slice as what we used yeah. last time. That I can manage. Right, so into the butter, we're going to add one teaspoon of Dijon mustard, please. Okay. Beautiful. Now it's up to you what you want to use for this on your preference. Uh, I like Dijon mustard, but you can go for English mustard if you want to go a little bit stronger. What's what have we got to go in? These Which are sunflower it? seeds. Wonderful. Right, yeah. so we're going to add some breadcrumbs to this, and you see we're starting to get more of a crumbly mix there, Nick's especially on the table with Nick throwing it everywhere. Right, yes, this one And if we can go for a good handful of the oats going in there as well, please. And Sam, can you open yeah. up the, the stilton for me? Yeah. That's enough. That should be fine. I'm going to wash my hands. Yeah, that's all right, normal. If you would like to pour that just over the top for me. I guess you don't worry about the lumps. It's cheese. No, it's, it's fine. Melt anyway, the, right? the beauty with this sort of recipe is it's going to go into the oven at a high heat and it's going to just melt down the cheese on top. You want to put that into the oven for around 15 to 20 minutes. Okay. About 180, 190. Or until it starts to go brown on top, basically. Careful. Yeah. So what do we do now in this spare time? I think you two should tidy up. No. How good does that look? That looks amazing. Yummy. So there you have how to make the gorgeous vegetarian crumble. We also made potatoes to check out how to make them. They're on the last video that we did. So there you go, sister. Oh, that looks so Get good. Your salad on there. This is going to be really boring for you to watch this bit. So we'll leave you there. Bye. Bye. So there you go, guys. And don't forget to like this video if you've liked it and subscribe to the Mum's Eye View channel.